It washes away the pollen, but it could take something else with it. One Athens home found that out the hard way. For people like Stan Brown, when the rain comes, so does business. Yeah, this is a good time of year for the tree business, that's for sure. Stan Brown owns Topps Tree Service. He says business goes up around 30% in April and May. But the rainy season isn't the only thing to blame. Georgia's past is coming back to haunt it. Brown says the long drought 10 years ago is causing problems in trees now. You end up with a shallow root base and, and with uh, gives a little bit of rain and a little wind that blows it over a lot easier. Now a tree this big falling in your yard is a lot to clean up, but an insurance company says that if it's weather related, you don't have to pay for it. Allstate, for example, will do inspections and warn their customers for potential dangers. We want our customers to know that, hey, this doesn't look right, it doesn't look good, this is a potential for a future claim. It would be great if you would, you know, trim it back or even cut it down. Brown says there are clues to know when a tree may fall. You watch the ground, you start seeing the root ball actually raise some, and, and that's, one, uh, that's one way to tell. He also says to make sure trees' limbs are even and to cut branches hanging over your home. Small projects like that, Brown says, you can do on your own. Most everyone seems to have a brother-in-law uh, that will cut the tree if you got a six-pack of beer and a good ladder and saw, but. Uh...